down. So it's, it's in gear. Good to go. We're map three, you leave it there, you should be good to yep. go. Yep, alright, awesome. Go out and grab a few. Feel for it, yeah, yeah. yeah. Feel for it. No, I'll cruise around for the first few. Right Holy shit, this is fast. No foot brake, gotta remember that. Jesus Christ, no foot brake, guys, just keep forgetting. This is so fast, it's not funny. Like, oh my god. This is at like 40 horsepower, I'm pretty sure. I keep reaching for the foot brake. Oh my god. It's so fucking fun. Oh, I nearly died. Again, back brakes there. That's actually a fend. It's crazy how much like the throttle in the air just moves it. just died. Okay. The best bike I've ever ridden by far.
Aussie foot brake model. Oh, I hate that. I hate not having something to put my hand on. It's just so weird. Tell you what. Fucked up, dude. It's not well. So Will and I just got off the Starks. Um, we were at like 45 horsepower. We rode the foot brake and the handbrake model. And I shit you not, Will and I both think the same. It was the best fucking motorbike we've ever ridden. Like literally, everything about it was unfucking paralleled Had so much grip, just went straight, jumped absolutely mint. Like it just, if you endo in the air or something like that, you give it a bit of throttle and it just straightens itself out. Um, 
literally gnarly. It's so good. Uncomparable. You just go into a corner. You can be in any situation. You don't have to worry about gearing or anything. And it's just, yeah, you can go into a corner shit, come out great. You're not worrying about gears or really breaking because it's just there. Like, it's pretty instant. The other thing is, if say, if you're drifting or something, like, the back end kicks out, it's so controllable. Like, it doesn't ever go out and kick back in. It's just a smooth, like fucking drift like it is literally uncomparable so um yeah i guess we're gonna have to cough up 20 grand plus a generator, generator.